Welcome. In front of me is a Xiaomi 12T Pro and today I'll show you how we can hard reset this device through recovery mode. Now, in addition, this process will also allow you to remove screen locks. So if you have one set that you just don't know, you can get rid of it this way. I'll also mention this right now, just so there is no misconception anywhere, that by doing so, most likely your device will become FRP locked, meaning once the reset is finished, you will need to, while going to the setup of the device, you will need to verify uh, that the phone belonged basically to you by either using the previously set up screen lock or by using Google account that was logged in on this device. Now, this will not show up if the only protection on this device is a screen lock and there is no Google account. If you have a Google account and a screen lock and you do this, the phone will become locked. Now, I'll also be making a video on how we can bypass this later on. So if you're interested in that, uh, that is something that might interest you then stick around. Next video will be basically that. So anyway, let me lock this phone right now, just so you can see I do have a lock screen and I will progress from the lock screen as though I don't know my pattern right here. So let's hold the power key. Select power off. And when the phone turns off, you wanna hold power and volume up at the same time. So let's do that right now. And once you see the me logo on the screen, should be visible any moment. There we go. Once you see it, you can let go of the keys. And this should take us into recovery mode in a moment. There we go. Now in here, using volume keys to navigate, you wanna select wipe data and confirm it with power key. Then select wipe all data. Again, confirm it. And then select confirm. As you can see, begins. It doesn't even go through to 100% and just gets like five and finishes instantly. Uh, so here we're just gonna now start spamming bu uh, power button. So back to main menu, reboot, reboot system to or to system. And obviously it reboots the device and continues the process in the background. So just give it like two, three minutes to finish this up. And once it's completed, it will be then presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your phone however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.